Page wrappers are a way to brand your Action Network pages with your own colors and logo. You can auto-generate wrappers really easily or even customize the wrappers using JavaScript and CSS. In this video, we will go over the simple process of auto-generating a page wrapper. Now, before we get started, page wrappers are a partner feature. If you're interested in becoming a partner, please visit actionnetwork.org partnerships. To begin, we'll go to the Start Organizing menu and select Page Wrappers. Then select your group from the drop-down menu. And as you can see, we have a list of all of our current Page Wrappers. To start a new one, click this blue Add New Wrapper button. You can either create your own header and footer code here, or auto-generate one with just an image. We'll go ahead and click to auto-generate a new wrapper. Then select an image from your computer that is no wider than 400 pixels. It's important that the image is this size, so it looks good across all devices and internet browsers. Next, you'll select two colors, a header color and an accent color. The header color will be in the page banner here, and the accent color is the color for the text in the goal slider, and links like the group name in the sponsored by section the click here and the submit button. So we'll go ahead and just select a header color and an accent color. Then click to build your wrapper. When you auto generate a wrapper, it will overwrite any custom work that you've done in the coding or title section already. So make sure to go back and add any custom coding that you want. So we'll go ahead and give our wrapper a name. Then add any other coding that you want. And then you can either save and preview the wrapper or save. Let's go ahead and preview it. So as you can see, the logo that we picked out is centered and the banner color is that first top color and the accent color is for these links. Up at the top, you'll see this preview and action type. Here you can select any action type and see what your page wrapper looks like across all sorts of actions. Note that you cannot preview an action with a page wrapper when you're drafting an action. So make sure you preview the page wrapper before you actually put it on the action when you create it. Then we'll save our page wrapper. And that brings us to a list of all of our page wrappers. To preview the one you just made, if you haven't already, you can click the preview button or even edit and duplicate the wrapper you already made. You can also change the default wrapper. Just click that blue make default button and it will show up across all of your actions automatically. But you can have multiple page wrappers and use them interchangeably if you want. Let's take a look at how to do that. And on the form manage page, you'll see this page wrapper and then a drop down menu. My default wrapper at the time is this AM staff deserve ice cream one, but I can change that and just select a new wrapper and click save. And that's it for page wrappers. If you have any further questions about page wrappers or any of our other features, please visit help.actionnetwork.org.